What's going on people today? I come back to you with another one and this time it is a new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles character, a brother, Marco. Now, I was so gassed when I created this that I just, I intended to put it out for Saturday or whatever, but, or Sunday, but I was like, nah, I gotta get out, gotta get it out as soon as possible. So here it is. Um, yeah, so let's go. So because I went into it knowing what weapon I wanted to give him, I had to give him a posture that showed off the weapon's ability. And so I went I went with the, the posture you see before you. Um, and I think it ended up, though I had another idea where he was like like swinging it, almost like a, like a nunchuck, just, just standing up. But um, I decided to go with this one instead. So here when I was drawing the hand, like I've drawn hands so many times, but you get used to drawing hands with five fingers and how that looks. And as soon as you draw a hand that has technically two fingers and one thumb, it completely throws, at least it throws me off anyway, when I was drawing it. So I found it difficult to, to get the look right. It was difficult, but I, I think I got it right in the end. So yeah, when I decided, so I was looking at several different like Asian weapons, cause obviously um, Leonardo, he uses the, the katanas. Um, Michelangelo uses the, uh, I don't even know what you call it, but it looks like a, tr no, he, Michelangelo uses the nunchucks. Raphael uses the um, the trident looking things. I don't know what you call them. And of course, uh, Donatello uses a stick. I know it's called something official, but let's call it a stick for now. Cause I don't know what else is called. So I wanted to give them, I wanted to give Marco here like an Asian style weapon. So I was looking online da, 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 and I found these ones and I was like, okay, this would be cool. On top of that, when I found it online, I was like, it reminded me of Kratos with the chains and the, and the, the blades of chaos. So I, w I went with these and um, I like them. I like them a lot. I like the style of them. So yeah.
so when i'm drawing the outline um just just for those wondering like where where i go thick and where i go thin anytime there's like a connection of two things so for example a joint is where i might go thick on a line and then thin also and also depending on where the light is i'll go thin around the line when there's shade i'll go thicker so that's how it works So I recently watched the video by David Finch, who I'm pretty sure did Marvel comics at one point in time. Um, so check him out if, you, if you're interested in drawing. But anyway, um, and the way he does inking, penciling, whatever, really helped me to understand the way I should do inking because the way I'm inking here, like I'm super happy with what I've created here at this point in the video. And, but if I compare it with like my Wolverine drawing or whatever, or even the drawings previously, um, it doesn't look as good to me. So yeah, I prefer it this way. So when I was thinking about the the 
color of his headband. I, I obviously Donatello is is a uh, purple, Leonardo's blue, Michelangelo's orange, Raphael's red. So I was like, I don't want I don't want a color that clashes with any of those colors. So I considered maybe like a bright yellow. Eh, that doesn't look that good. Also clashes with orange a little bit. Um, I think I was considering like a dark green, but that clashes with his overall color being green. And I think I also considered white as well, but I didn't like the idea of that. So I, can, I ended up on black, and I think black overall looks really cool. But let me know if you think there's any other colors that would look good as well, because I can't think of any. So that is the end of the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. This was a super cool one. This is easily the, the best drawing I've done so far. And um, if you look at where how I started off drawing my own stuff, compared to now it's it's at least for me anyway it's night and day so i'm very happy with, with my progress and uh, i hope you guys enjoyed it too so yeah i'll see you later bye